pickup line congestion today at a West Chase school. Neighbors are telling us that cars are now clogging up their local streets and they're even hopping the curbs to get around all the traffic as they pick up the kids. Well, tonight, ABC Action News reporter Heather Lee joining us live from Kingsbridge Drive, where some of those neighbors are taking action tonight. Heather. Well, Paul, folks living across the street from Davidson Middle School say this street gets so clogged up that it has gotten so bad. Many of them have decided to just put up no parking signs in their driveway so that they aren't trapped here. Cars piling up in the afternoon is standard on Montague Street and Limebaugh Avenue. It's a matter of time before a kid gets hit. Tanya Baumover sees how congested the neighborhood streets get every day when school gets out at Davidson Middle and West Chase Elementary. Plus, the Robinson IB bus is dropping kids off at Davidson for the first time this year. It is impossible for emergency vehicles to get through during dismissal. We have kids who are darting in and out of traffic. She says many parents do risky things to avoid traffic, like backing into Kingsbridge Drive because they can't make a right turn. She says more space for drivers to sit and wait would be good, but the Hillsborough County School District isn't sure that's something it can do. We do have the real estate to do that. I just, I mean, it costs money, and I'm just not sure that the county has the resources to do something that large. Working with the West Chase Association and the county, they've been trying to change the timing of certain lights to allow more traffic through. Adding an officer would be costly, 300 bucks a day for traffic control. The only other option, getting more kids to walk and bike to school. Now, the Hillsborough County School District says after a week or two, things typically calm down, but they are asking parents to please don't park in these neighborhood side streets. Go ahead and remain in that car line, of course, for the safety of the children. For now, we're live in West Chase. Heather Lee, ABC Action News.